God, the sun is shining, the birds is chirping. Such a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Just finished a long weekend, looking forward to getting back to training with the classics. Big week coming up ahead. Ah! Excited, baby. Right now, just on the way to the office, go handle some biz. Because you know, I'm not a businessman. I'm a business man. Let me handle my business, damn. Crazy how fast I came here, man. But yo, in business, you always gotta cross your T's and dot your I's, keep all your documents, keep track of all your expenses, everything, man. Keep track of everything. Because every chance you get, there's someone trying to put their hand in your pocket. There's someone trying to take your paper. So you, if you ain't about your business, if you ain't on your P's and Q's, plus believe they're gonna Mike Tyson you out here. They're gonna MC Hammer you. You gotta be like your boy Hove. Be like, you know, your boy Diddy. Stay on top of your business. Handle your business. And like. From the office, submitting some documents. Still got some more to submit. And then I'm gonna come back, pick up that. It's a day in the life. Oh, I need some stamps. And then we're out here, Old Milton. Look at these new cribs, B. Look at these new cribs, B. And then look at the old cribs, B. Man's just making money out here, you know? Take a crib like this, knock it down, build a crib like that. You know what I mean? You're laughing, bro. Trust me, there's so much money out here. Like, if man's had their guap up, it'd be easy to make real estate flips. But that's the, that's the idea, you know? Start off as an agent, build up my savings, work my way up to developer. Agent to broker to developer. That's the, that's the transition, man. Taking Big ass one lots. Year. And then you knock something like this down, and build something like this, Easy, make money. right. So I'm at the soccer shop now. Man's got to pick up some jerseys, and also I got to get my coach's uniform. Oh, look at this. That's what I'm talking about, yo. These guys know what's up. Buy an old house like this, <laughs> build something like that, yo. Yo, come, come, come. Good, 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 good. Bring it in, Kevin. Yo, so I just wanted to reiterate uh, the point I made at the beginning of practice of, you know, the first step to achieving success or greatness, if you want to put it that way, is deciding what it is you want to achieve, you know? So if you don't have an aim of what it is you want to become or what it is you want to do, then of course you're never going to get to it. But once you set up in your mind what it is you're trying to achieve or what you want to do, then from that point, it becomes much easier to achieve success because you have a clearly defined goal, you know? It's just like a boat. If you put a boat out into the water, it's going to go wherever the ocean takes it, you know? If you put a kid in high school, it's going to go wherever his friends are going. It's just going to float along, you know what I'm saying? But if you can put a boat with a destination and a crew, you know? 100% of the time that boat's gonna get from point A to point B because it knows where it needs to go and then it charts the course and then proceeds to go along that course to get to where it needs to go. It's the same thing. If you put a determined kid in high school who's, I'm gonna become a professional soccer player, I'm going to university, you know, he's not gonna fall temptation to the girls or to the drugs or to the cigarettes, you know, or to the parties because he has a clear vision of what he, he wants to achieve. And then from there, he'll attract the crew, you know, based on the strength of his character. So you don't need to be following what other people are doing or trying to be cool. Just stay focused on what it is you're trying to do, what you want to achieve, and for sure you'll achieve it. But take the time, if you haven't already, to reflect, to meditate, to think about what it is you want to achieve, who it is you want to be, and what you want to become. And once you decide, let me know. And anything I can do to help you, I'll do. You know, Whether it's more tutoring, if you need to get from 80s to 90s, or if it's more... You know, more more training. If you feel like I want to go pro, like that's what I want to do once I graduate high school. Or if it's, you know, I need to get scholarships, then we start contacting coaches from now. But you need to let me know exactly what it is you're trying to achieve. And from there, it could be much easier for me to try to help you guys out. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Something like that.